Hey guys, what's up? It's Absol225 here, back at you again with another video. And today, we are playing something a little bit different. We are playing a game called Floating Sandbox. I'm sure you've seen this on, like, Ray Still Plays or some other channel. I don't freaking know. But, uh, yeah, this game is really, really fun. It's on Game Jolt, and it's free. There's a bunch of options. You probably can't see them because the way it is. Video capture works. Eh, eh, bah. Whatever. Anyway, have you ever seen wanted to see the Titanic just collapse in on itself? Because you can do that. Have you ever just wanted to slam it into the bottom of the ocean so that the movie speed up, speeds up and you don't have to sit through like three hours? BAM! Vaporized! <laughs> it can reload the ship like nothing happened. Except, of course, for mass destruction. Anyways. Let's see. There's an array of ships you can hit have here. It's amazing. Wait, what? There's a... There's a Dalek. Oh. It's not indestructible. I just love doing this personally. It's just satisfying. To absolutely just cut the freak out of something. And now it's in a million tiny pieces. That is so cool. That is so cool. It's just a metal confetti. I, there are some options here that uh can really mess stuff up. Uh, let's see. Water density, yeah, a little bit more. Or drag it up, just eh, intake up, craziness up a little bit, diffusion, jack that up. <laughs> what does this do? Oh, <clears throat> oh, it just oh. Anyway, there's even more tools than just slicing and, uh, you know, any other stuff. You can just grab a piece and pull it off. Grab another piece and just pull it off. Grab this. You don't like it? Just pull it off, you know? Yeet! Want to drag it underwater? You can drag it underwater. Slam it into the ocean floor. Have it collapse in on itself while you're at it. And then there's bombs. Oh, wait. Thanos snap. So satisfying. Also, a little funny thing about it. It leaves ripples in the water. They could potentially make, like, trenches... Of just <laughs> you can just make extremely large gaps in the water, which is just hilarious to me. <laughs> it's just extremely unrealistic, and it's the best thing ever. Anyway, let's get our ship back. All right. Here we have a Dalek. And let's see. And we 
have about half a dollar. Oh, 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 what is happening? <laughs> the bar is ripping apart! Also, the glory will hold it down the more power it builds up. And then the more it absolutely disintegrates stuff. And when it's at full power. <laughs> what is happening? I've never had this happen before. Anyway. Okay. Let's try a different ship, actually. Uh let's see. Let's see. What what the fuck? Ooh. Carnival ship. Carnival cruise liner. Okay. Ooh. Jesus, come on. Can you get to move? But we're not here to drive stuff. Well, we are, but not in a traditional sense. Traditional. What was I trying to say? Trigger lightning. That just tore this little thing in, like apart. But the best thing you can do is there's button commands. So if you press Alt and L over and over, you can just have consecutive lightning strikes. It is the best thing ever. Because you can just methodically tear the ship apart. It's great. Press the ship focus here. All the lightning rods aren't helping you now. Oh, oh, it's just slowly tearing a hole into the center of a boat, if you see right there. Like, this area. It was just starting to drill into the boat. <laughs> Ugh. Also, you can trigger tsunamis. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Oh lord, it coming. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna flood the boat because of the open roof. Oh no! Can you tunnel through the boat? Is it Oh, oh, have you ever wanted to see a cruise liner do acrobatics? What? What? Where'd it go? Huh? Where, what happened? Like, is it still, is it alive? Where'd it go? Where'd he go? I'm gone. He gone. What? I don't understand what happened. Huh? Okay, let's just. All right, let's try a a different command here. Summon uh, storm. Let's whip up a storm real quick. Yeah, you know, you're just cruising along. And then suddenly the clouds start moving a bit faster than usual. Alright, let's just sit back and watch this play out. And then you start to see the gray clouds, you know? That's when you know stuff is about to go down. <laughs> uh oh. Lightning. What are storms exactly? do other than just like trigger lightning. What? Oh. Oh rain. I bet if you it would just kinda like slowly but surely fill up with rain. 
Apples do you want to see absolute destructive force? Because I can show you absolute destructive force. <laughs> okay, the water density is so freaking crazy that it just kind of pulls things apart. What? <laughs> have to test with this water a little bit because <laughs> what in the world are the properties of this all right let's just say like straight up happy to all right uh test successful question mark What does that do? Okay. What? Where? Where'd he go? What? I, I, I don't understand at all. If we just... Then... We'll just... Like... Okay, the water's a black hole. All right then. Let's just strap a bomb to it. <laughs> and see what happens. Oh. Oh, it's incredibly strong. But it's not like oh Oh, there's fire. Oh, that makes the bomb go off a lot faster. Whoa! It's gone! <laughs> what is causing that? I genuinely don't know, and I want to know. Okay. Time for something a little bit like I'm used to. Let's just try a good old antimatter bomb. Or a few of them. Alright. We just have to make the first impact. Or. Well, I'm not sure how to detonate this other than just kind of... Oh boy! Where? Where did they go? Oh! The speedometer no longer works. <laughs> I am going to try my hardest to reset to reset to default. <laughs> Setting one on everything. Because I'm pretty sure the black hole is caused by the water settings. And that's no good. Water density, bring that back down to one. <laughs> Water craziness? Yeah, bad idea. Fusion speed. <sighs> Maybe that's what was causing it to just go absolutely fuck wild whenever it just came in contact with an open space. Maybe. Or does that just happen? It seems to be alright.
I wonder, what happens if we just, like, set the spring strength to something absolutely garbo? If I can find springs. Ooh. Oh. Oh. I found some other stuff. Oh. Ooh. I'll just keep those at default, but uh. <laughs> Hold on. Do you ever just feel like the ship and just. You know. <laughs> that was the fan. That was the fan of Snap on steroids. <laughs> that was incredible. All right. And cool. Is it not affected? Oh, it's not affected by that. Oh. <laughs> and the pieces go flying. What happened? <laughs> oh. oh, it's glorious. What's this? Like, that's from Subnautica. Have you ever just wanted to destroy the Cyclops? Like, ever? I feel like it's just gonna straight up keep sinking. Nope. Nope. Oh, it's starting to... Buoyancy. It's starting to take place. Okay. Well. I'll see how ridiculous the antimatter bomb has gotten. If, judging by what just happened, oh, it's not ready. <laughs> it's just doing kind of like a Milky Way Spiral Galaxy type thing. Oh, and it goes. Whoa! Oh, there's a Brigitte! Brigitte! Ooh! That looks sick. Oh, I just got an idea. So there's this barrier on the map, right? Right here? Let's just slam it into there. Let's see what happens. All right. <laughs> it just becomes dust. A bit of dust. You can just slam it back in. Slam it back. Pretty sure if you just grab a part, like grab a particle, then you can just slam it over and over. Ooh. Oh.
friends if we... Hmm. Now I have some interesting ideas. Oh boy. Let's see. Uh, hey. Hmm. There's a bunch of stuff to do with fire. E. Bumpy. I'm gonna jump. You can adjust the ocean depth for detail. Set zero. Set really high. Friction? Friction. Health density. Ooh. <laughs> Let's see. <sighs> what have I done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Oh, the poor boy's just gonna be getting thrown around. Oh, the poor boy's just getting thrown around. Up. What happens if I use the uh, wave tool on this? Hold on, if I can find it. Wait, what happens if I trigger a tsunami? Oh, a tsunami in the middle of gigantic waves. Oh boy. This game's just really entertaining. Like, it's always just a question of what is going to happen. What events will unfold? Sea spike. Sea spike. Sea spike. Sea spike. And then reach. Rip through, rip through, rip through. Yes! Oh, that was so cool. Oh, that looks so cool. I might actually end it here. As it just falls into nothingness. Let me expedite the process. Anyways, I'll do it. Like, comment if you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and also hit that bell if you want to receive new updates on when I make a new video or when I'm live streaming. Also, follow me on Twitch. I am Clockwork TV. C L O C K W R K, I'm pretty sure. And also, TikTok. Clockwork. C L O C K T L O C K W R K. Go follow me on that. And as always, hold up. <laughs> I just realized that I got it. Eh, software, where are you? There you are. Okay. And as always, ciao.